welcome to Live in Hawaii. I'm your host, Crystal, and today we're at the H-Zone at Ward Center, your one-stop shop for all your UH gear. Let's go check it out. the store manager of the H Zone. Megan, how are you doing? Good, how are you? I'm doing great. I am so excited to be here. You know, um, I think you can find everything for a UH fan in here, but you know, most people think of this as the Rainbow Teak. Can you explain that? There's like a little transition going on. Yeah, um, Rainbow Teak was run by the University of Hawaii Bookstore, but two years ago, um, Athletics just took over and um, now we have three locations run by the athletic department. We have the Ward Store, we have Stan Sheriff Arena, and the Les Murakami Baseball Stadium. Which I think it's actually more appropriate that the athletic department <laughs> handle the, the sports store right. where fans can come and represent mm -hmm. their teams. Right. And I love that this is at Ward Center where actually everyone can come and find parking and not have to fight into the university. Yeah. I know UH is kind of crazy. Right. Yeah. Where's, where's this store and this store and yes. you know they'll end up in someone's classroom, right? <laughs> and you know what's really cool is I've seen that some of the old retro logos are coming back. Yes, we do. Um, a lot of the fans are always asking for the retro logo, old school fans, so they, we try to bring it back as much as possible. And, you know, there's a lot of variety. I think most people kind of assume there's a lot of menswear, but mm -hmm. there's a lot for everyone. Yeah, everybody. So we have them for the kids. We have for the women. Um, we also have a lot of locals and c tourists coming over here, too. Oh, nice. I mean, I see cute little like stuffed animals mm -hmm. for kids. I see like outfits for um, toddlers and even, you know, you know, if you want to dress your baby up and like, right. uh, you know, a little baseball, <laughs> like how adorable. <laughs> I was a UH dancer, so I would like shop and shop and shop and try to find like the UH green. Right. And yes. now you have so much variety for women. Mm -hmm. And I think that's like fantastic yeah. and not only do you have you know most I think people see that there's basketball and there's mm -hmm. baseball and some of the major sports but you have something for every sport yeah we have a sports series uh, we have stuff for water polo beach volleyball sailing so we try to bring in for every sport as much as possible awesome so no matter what sport as long as it's UH mm -hmm. you can come <laughs> yes. and represent mm -hmm. yeah I love it well you know what the models are about to arrive but before they get here would you mind picking out a few outfits for me okay sure. All right. All right, let's go. <laughs> All right, Maggie, get me ready for these UH games coming up. All right, well, we're going to have to get you some pants. Look at this one. Oh, I like it. Yeah. Like, oh, so comfy. Yep. <laughs> okay, so you can take that. These are dark. So you want to get some light. Do you know how long I've been waiting for, like, cute shirts like these? <laughs> so here you go. Here's one. These are Under Armour too, right? Yeah, and you might Super want to pair cute. that with one of our sports bras sports here. Bra. There you go. Love it. Okay, and let's see, maybe um, some leggings. Leggings? Right. You can get this one. Here. Oh, these are cute. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I love them. So perfect. It'll keep you dry and cool. Do it. Yeah, ooh, these are one of the retro. Yes, let's put you in a retro one. Logo. Sometimes we do have retro nights at the games. So, do one of these. Love it. Okay. Perfect. And then maybe if it gets cold, I want to do a long sleeve. A long sleeve? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, this way. They have like this little cow neck long yeah. sleeve shirt. Oh, this is comfy too. Yeah. Is this dry fit? Yes, this is dry fit. Perfect. Yeah. And it also got the little thumb holes as well. Oh. Perfect for runners. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm ready to try it on. It's so good. good. <laughs> All right, hey. I feel great in this. I would, I love these, um, these capris. You know, as a dancer, these are really, really comfortable. I feel like I could wear this to every practice and be like the coolest UH dancer ever. <laughs> but no, these these tops, I mean, I think they're all made from Under Armour, so they're all dry fit and really comfortable and it moves really well, so I'm excited to try my next outfit. <laughs> all right, so I'm wearing the old school retro logo shirt and it's super comfy. They made it, I don't know, they made it in such like a soft cotton material, um, but I feel like I could use this uh, you know, wear this at all the UH games. Um, I don't know, to practice anything, to, to class. This is really, really comfortable and I think it just really shows off my UH pride. 
<laughs> I feel like a serious athlete right now. <laughs> no, I'm really loving these sweatpants. They're not the classic, I think, thick sweat cotton pants that you get. They're thin, they're comfy, and then I think they really accentuate as they taper down to your ankle. Um, I'm wearing their cowl neck uh, runners jacket, I guess you could say, with the thumb holes. But this is great, it's super comfortable. I feel like I could run like miles in these, especially with my UH hat. I feel ready to go. <laughs> I'm so excited, I'm gonna run out of here. I'm so pumped for UH right now, but don't go away because the models are about to arrive and pick out their own selection, and you don't want to miss that. Woo! Okay, let's go. Let's look yes. for something for a workout. I'm excited. This is so cute. I think this is all we need. <laughs> I kind of wanted something for myself, yeah. but... <laughs> oh, I need... Oh, you know what? Look at these. I'm in love with these. Oh, they look really, really comfy. Oh, they're so Destiny. I actually do not believe in ghosts, but saying that, having said that, I'm kind of scared now because I feel like I might get a visit and I'll start believing in ghosts. I would want to trade lives with Anthony Bourdain because he basically just gets to travel the world, eat, and get paid for it. The only thing is, I would have to figure out a way to keep the weight off, basically. I'm gonna try it on. I know it's... Yeah? Yes. <laughs> okay. Now, Probably where's your bottom? Pants. <laughs> Step one, get pants. Oh, these are cute. Brie? Yes, I think all of those stories definitely exist for a reason, and they've been around forever, so I definitely believe in them. Um, probably like a trapeze artist in a traveling circus because they get to travel around with a bunch of like really cool weird people and do cool and weird things every day. Um, I think it would be really fun. I don't know, maybe, hopefully. <laughs> what do you think? Ooh. I think I'm sold. <laughs> I, don't, I don't even know if I should try it on. I think I'm gonna buy it. <laughs> I like it. Oh, are these up? Yeah, we can be in style. Yeah. Like, we're so cute. You know? <laughs> be prepared for the rain. I'm gonna leave this on. Yep, I'm getting these ones. Alright. Let's go try it on. Very good. Do you have ready? everything? Do you I have everything. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go. I definitely believe that there's more to life than just the physical world. I would want to be an American Ninja Warrior because those people are so strong and so agile and athletic and I'm always really inspired when I'm watching them on TV lying on my couch. It's very retro. Reminds me of my alma mater. Yes, I love that logo. I'm Gabriella. I do. I think that everybody has had some sort of encounter whether they acknowledge it or not. And we've, we've got to find a way to contact that other world. <laughs> um, I think I would trade lives with Kim Kardashian. I definitely love that she has a huge family support. There's always things going on. And you know, who wouldn't want to be on a reality show all day? <laughs> I think that's really cute. These Ooh, pants are cute. Look at this rim here. Oh, I love that. I definitely need some workout pants for my, my sweatshirt. Oh, I think we're, oh, we're composed. Yes. Let's get our little friend. 
top off my outfit, put my hair back. Yeah, that's think great. This would be really cute. And you can wear it out to class, too, right. if you want to. Exactly, exactly. Maybe I'll just go classic. Yeah. yeah. Classic. That's classic. But I do like this retro one. The retro Rainbow Warriors. Okay, you gotta one. love the old school stuff. I know. I love that they're bringing it back. A little Rainbow Warrior action. All right. All right, so now it's time for our lunch break. We're gonna walk over to Bellini to grab a quick bite to eat. So don't go away. Hey guys, so we're here at Bellini and we are about to order. Before we get there, I want to hear what you girls thought about each zone. I thought it was great. You know, I'm a huge volleyball fan. I play every week and I'm constantly looking for new workout gear. And you know, at um, each zone, it was really comfortable. All the clothing that they had, the, it was stretchable. I thought it was really cute. So I loved it. Yeah, it was so cute, but also so practical. Everything is Under Armour, so you're ready to go to the gym and really get a good workout. But it's so cute enough to go out grocery shopping after, hang out, catch a bite with your friends. And they also had a lot of great colors. Not only could you rep, you know, the classic UH green, but they also had pinks and whites, grays, blacks. So something for everyone to enjoy. I'll say it again, but it was really cute and comfy, just like they said. Um, everything in there was fantastic, and there was a really good mix of new and old logos and designs that they were throwing around, so there's something for everybody. All the old alma maters out there can get their original logos, and then you know you got some new, some new stuff going on there too, so. Yeah, so on top of all the great UH gear for us, I love that they had some themed items too. They had um, the pink for breast cancer awareness, and then they had all the cute little baby things. They had the onesies that were like the basketball and the baseball, and then also the cute little girls cheerleader costume, which I love so much. So. I have to agree with you guys. I think the variety that they had, I was very surprised by it and very pleasantly surprised. I think we all had fun trying on the clothes and imagining ourselves like working really hard <laughs> in the gym. Yeah. Um, but, you know, I think the best part is that all the proceeds of H Zone goes back to the university, you know, goes back to all those students that are trying to achieve that higher education. So awesome. All right, everyone. So stick with us because we're about to order and you don't want to miss that. Hey everyone, I'm here with the general manager of Bellini, Janelle. How are you doing? I'm doing great, thank you. Yeah, well, I'm doing fantastic. We just had an incredible spread, a variety of what Bellini has to offer. Can you tell me a little bit about the background of the restaurant? Okay, uh, Bellini Bistro, we've been here for one year and we're owned by Miley Sangora. She also owns Miley's Thai Bistro. I love Miley's Thai Bistro, by the way. Like, I always, I go there and it's such flavorful food and that's exactly what I got here. <laughs> well, when I come, when, if I come back, you know, and which I will, what do I need to get? Like, the absolute thing I need to get. 
Okay, there's so many, so I'm just going to come up with a bunch. So definitely the Bellini platter with a glass of wine. Um, the chicken meatball meat sauce, which is not on the menu, it's off menu. I'm so sorry. But you can have chicken meatball, you can have bolognese, but you put it together. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then also the Penang pasta, which is a like a fusion dish. It's chicken and bell peppers and carrots cooked Italian style, and we fold it in with a Penang sauce with linguine. It's so awesome. Well, you know, the one thing I love is that this is a locally owned restaurant. Yes. What makes Bellini so unique? Well, we take uh, what Miley has learned from her family, because her family also owns many Italian restaurants, and she's done local elements. So we have some Asian sauces, we have island fish, we use local produce, and so we kind of twist it. So yeah. we're definitely not authentic, but we're island, island Italian. I love it, and I loved uh, the the dessert that we had with the Kona coffee, and it was like a bonbon. Oh, yeah. yeah, it was That's also oh, it was so amazing <laughs> that I definitely have to come back. Well, thank you so much for having us and for just the incredible presentation that your staff brought. Thank you for coming. All right. Chocolate and mascarpone and chocolate mousse. 
Yeah, I'm like, oh I need gosh. punch. Yeah, I must say, because yeah. these two compliment each other. gotta ask me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mambo number five. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Mambo number oh. five. <laughs> Came out a little country. Hey everyone, so we just finished lunch and I'm so impressed with everything that they had to show us. But what did you girls think? I think the chicken parmesan was amazing. It was cheesy, it was so delicious. It came on a bed of penne pasta and that with the chicken and the cheese just complemented each other so well. And I think I'm gonna take a nap right after this. <laughs> yeah, I definitely have a Kanak attack too. I had a B-L-T-A-E, so your bacon, lettuce, tomato, but with avocado and an egg that was fried perfectly. So the yolk was just dripping out and it was this great sauce, but it was so refreshing because of the lettuce and tomato, crispy bacon with these perfectly cut shoestring fries. Oh my goodness, it was so, so satisfying. Even the appetizers were amazing here. They gave us like little baby bruschetta. They were so cute and delicious. And they gave us this amazing lobster. It had like garlic and butter and there was just tons. They weren't kidding when they said there was garlic in it. There was tons of it and that was extremely fantastic. Um, they also gave us like a cheese platter with meat and little olives and pickles and everything. They literally covered it all just with the appetizers. It was amazing. So I had the crowd favorite, the lobster carbonara. It had these huge chunks of lobster, this great smoky flavor with lots of caramelized onions, a great cream sauce. Oh my goodness, it was definitely my favorite here today. And then we had these great desserts today. We had a little Kona Trattura Tartufo. I'll learn how to say that before we leave today. Tartufo, and then we had a chocolate mousse cake with the layers of chocolate cake, mousse, and mascarpone. It was to die for. Well, you know, I had the chicken salt and boca sandwich, and that was really great. The, the meat, the chicken that was in there was so thick. And then on top of that, you know, you, there was a dip that it came with, and it was like a white wine, butter, garlic, mushroom dip that you just, you had to dip it in there because it was that good. Um, and I just, I think we had such an amazing day here at Bellini, and they, you know, treated us like royalty, and the presentation of everything was just fantastic. All right, everyone, so we're going to head back right now to H-Zone to check out the results of our photo shoot, so don't go away. And now it's time for Valerie Joseph's Style Tip of the Week. Hi, I'm Valerie Joseph, sharing style tips that work for you. Have you ever been stumped by the dress code on invitations? Well, you are not alone. Today, we're going to clarify the difference between business casual and business formal. Business casual is the standard dress code in most offices. A great option is to wear cropped black trousers, a fun blouse, and some light jewelry. Keep it relaxed and fashion forward. Business formal is often suggested for daytime semi-formal events such as work lunches and conferences. The idea behind this dress code is to wear something that is essentially a dressed up version of your best office wear. This can mean anything from a tailored dress to a white pants suit. Keep the color palette neutral to maintain an air of seriousness. I'm Valerie Joseph, sharing style tips to keep you fashionable, beautiful, and confident in your own skin. We've had such a great time shopping at the Age Zone and eating at Bellini. Don't forget to follow us on social media. I'm your host, Crystal, and we'll see you here next time on Live in Hawaii.